Attention! This is a fan-made spin-off and is not affiliated with any official Danganronpa companies or names. This is rated a 15. Viewer discretion is advised. Simple as, I'm the killer! I bet the killer froze Gala to death! And what about Mari? Her tentacles were singed with ash, remember? Mari flew out of the room on her own! Akapashio, Maria's toy, she can not fall. Ah, but she did. That's right, Mari flew out of the room before I tore her to shreds! Well, can you explain how then? You bet I can. Okay. The thing that will prove that Mary flew is... This audio recording that proves somehow Mary flew on her own! A an audio recording? Of what? It's a recording of Galler's last moments. While it's not the clearest recording, it proves his point. Monica, play the recording! Please, I can't hear that again. Okay, so how does this prove she can fly? Listen again. Great. Oh, it's so. Someone, let me out. Uh, hey, I didn't know you could fly. I just said I couldn't hear that again. Galore specifically questions Mary by saying, I didn't know you could fly. But I... I took Mari out of the room myself! What's he talking about? I believe your argument is cracking, small green girl! Trust me, she was lying to begin with. I killed Galor! Why can't you just convict me? Okay, so Mari was flying. How did she fly? And how did she get out of the room? You're not gonna tell me she phased through the wall, are you? <laughs> the door is the only way out of that room. And if the door was never opened for Galor, how did Mari leave? There's another exit from that room. I know it! Where does that go to? It goes to... The air duct that goes from Mary's room to the breaker room! Exactly! I killed Galor via the breaker room, with the thermostat, and then killed Mari after she emerged from the air vent. Well, no, because... Hold it! We're wasting time! Hurry up and vote! Good idea! Hold it! 
You keep saying Mari flew out of the room, but what does that even mean? She's a toy. She can't fly. Well... Easy. I can explain that one. Hey, Felicity! What was tied to Mari when you found her? Uh... Long string. No, that's wrong! Brucey, I'm not wrong. You were with me. Oh, what do you want? Ooh, it's not a string, it's a thread! I know. I just want to be the one who solves it. There was a long string... There was a long string attached to Mary, so the killer must have pulled her out from the room from the breaker room. No, that's wrong! <laughs> I always wanted to shout like you guys do. Do you have a genuine rebuttal? Yes! Listen up! I'm not usually allowed to point out contradictions, but you guys are pissing me off! What do you have to say then? Spit it out! You say a long string pulled Mari up? Do you have any idea how long the vent tunnels are? Um, no. We actually don't know that. Certainly not long enough for a two meter string to pass through. No, that's wrong! How? I'm not saying your point is inherently incorrect. Just the fact that the string could, in fact, be used. I'll prove it to you! Here's a diagram of the air vents. If I draw a two-meter line through them, it won't reach from the breaker room to Mari's. Now consider this. If you were to crawl through the vent yourself, then use a two-meter string at the entrance to Mary's room, you could pull her into the vents with you! That would give the illusion that she was flying. Well done, Sachi. Uh, excuse me? Mm-hmm. This is what I did. Prove that someone went through the vents. The thing that proves it is... This dusty trail from the wall just below the vent! That's not proof! I recall what Monacam told Felicity and I during the investigations. It was broken for a couple decades, I bet. He stated that the air vents had not been used for a couple decades. If something isn't used for that long, what is built up? Dust. Okay, so who had dust on them at Geller's time of death? The thing is... None of us know the exact time Galler was killed. I was covered in dust, so I brushed it all off. Simple as, it's not like a stain. You can easily remove it. If we could just figure out who had dust on them. No, that's wrong! Simply put, we don't need to figure that out. What do you mean by that? What we should be asking ourselves is, who could fit in the vent? I didn't even think of that! Let's look at a lineup of everyone. We can knock some suspects off already. Simply based off of the fact that they're the, well, the largest people here. Hey, I take offense to that. Bro, it wasn't a mean comment. S Sorry, Neo. Anyway, can we also take off Felicity and I because we were together the whole day? Uh, of course you were. For suspects are Toa, Asachi, Zoe, Gaia, and Arina as to who could have fit in the vent. Take 
Kai and Toa off the list because they were together the entire time. Yeah, I'm not a suspect. We have alibis. I don't have an alibi for that time. Oh, I guess he doesn't have an alibi. That's right. No, that's wrong! What? Of course you have an alibi! You were with me and Toa at your stupid castle! He was not. Gaia, what are you doing? She was with us the whole day! Never left my sight! Gaia, stop! You're lying! She's lying! She's lying! She's lying! Gaia, because she's right. Um, I was with her and... Anna was with us too. Why are you doing this? Stop lying! I was not with you! I killed Galor! So if those three have alibis, that leaves Asashi and Zoe. No! Asashi was with me the whole day too. He has an alibi. Oh, okay, my mistake. Zoe wasn't with us that whole day. We saw her in the morning and then when she came out of the elevator. I don't have an alibi. Are you the killer? No, but you can vote me if you'd like. Hey, that's not the attitude to have. You're still young. You got a lot of life to live. Yeah, something like that. Everyone has an alibi or cannot fit in the vent, apart from Zoe. I'm the killer! Not that lemon! Me! I believe she may have a motive as well. Huh? I do? Zoe was very attached to Mary. If someone were using her, and Zoe was desperate, is it hard to imagine her burning Galler and then heisting Mary out of the room? Then she could have her all to herself. I'll leave you in last place! I'm not a psycho! I wouldn't kill Galler because I needed some toy! I'm not a baby. You're the only one without an alibi. Don't pin me at some pathetic child! I don't need a stupid toy. And I definitely wouldn't kill Galler over it. I'm a strong woman. I don't need a comfort object. So stop saying that I do! I remember finding you asleep with Mary. So clearly you find some joy out of it. I can't imagine you kill someone. But I thought the same about Orion. the case to be sure. Zoe, did you really? I admit it. I killed Galler and Laurie.